Oh my god, it's so early. I can't even help myself making a slurpy noise when I'm drinking. LA, here I come. Right, I've woken up, I've had my coffee, I feel a little bit more alive now. Uh, how the devil are you? Excellent! Shall I not change gear into the lower gear? Go into the higher gear? That's better. There we go, fourth gear. Excellent. Anyway, um, how, yes, whoa, it's a good morning. Yes, we're, go we're going to LA. I can't see you. Uh, we're going to LA. Uh, oh, don't pretend to be asleep. <laughs> I'm really frigidly excited. I can't believe I've even done my hair this early in the morning. I know, although you do have it like falling down quiff kind of thing. That's kind of what I was going for today. Oh, excellent. That's, that's, so a that's a lucky we needed. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're flying off to America in like six hours. So we're on our way down to the uh, airport now. We're going to get parked up. Get ourselves checked in. Park and... Getting parked up sounds like we're going to do something very dodgy. Well, we are. Um, <laughs> And then we're going to leave the car behind as well. Right. And we're going to get checked in and we're going to blag our way into premium economy. And if we can't blag it, then we're going to pay for it because <laughs> we're both six foot four tall. Well, I am and Eid nearly is. And <laughs> on a plane for 11 hours with my knees underneath my chin, that ain't happening. Plus, if my knees are underneath my chin, we can't play Snakes and Ladders, which I brought with me. What? I'm so excited. And, oh, brilliant. and pass the pigs. Uh, what? <laughs> what oh, what? Oh, oh, you, you see, you're gonna learn something new on this flight. And there we are, coming into land. It's very clever. I gave my camera to someone uh, to film this. Uh, this is me doing a voiceover over the top. This, this. What? <laughs> that is a huge bugger. Look at the size of it. We're gonna be on something bigger than that in a moment. Oh, <laughs> is that good? Was that good? It is so freaking warm in here. And we're not even moving anyway. It's just this airport is ridiculous. It doesn't help when you're wearing a jacket, but. It is so warm. Anyway, right, we're going to get some food because we are famished. How hungry are you? Hungry. Give us a good flight. Oh my word. Free upgrades all the way. This is awesome. Look at, this. Look at that. Oh, 11 hours of my legs um, stretched out. 10 hours and 47 minutes actually. Ready then. Look at that. And look, look at that. And all the other films that are on there as well. There's loads of great films. There's G.I. Joe, there's Another Day to Die Hard, there's Iron Man 3. I'm going to have a whale of... There's even Scooby-Doo! Is that a movie? That's a, apparently so. Big Top Scooby-Doo. I'm, I'm going to be watching Big Top Scooby-Doo. Holy Mother Mary of Gods, 8,000 kilometres later. We're only in frickin' LA. Let's go to the toilet. Oh, wait a minute. No, that's what you just said. Uh, that's what I said earlier. We're in LA. <laughs> oh my God. We're actually here. Finally. It's been a really short flight. At least it has for you. It hasn't for us. So here we go. This is my VidCon bag. Oh, did, did you get a VidCon bag as well? You got a VidCon bag too. What glasses are these? Oh, well. Style Hall. I've got nerdy glasses from Style Hall. Yeah, and, a, and I've got a remote control. No, that's from the TV. What the um, Ah, poo tube is, I remember seeing this in somebody else's bag, it's like an, a pop potpourri that you spray in the toilet when somebody else has had a big dump. Oh, and nice. it means the toilet doesn't smell. Right. So you can use it after me, Sorry. and I can use it after you. Okay. Oh, it stinks! Go on, spray it! Ow. Spray it, spray it! You can't hear right, it! Right, can, can you spray it? Right, I'm gonna come oh. in now. I'm gonna, you get out of the way, and... Oh, oh that's, actually that smells really nice. Does it? It does. It went right on my nostrils. Well, don't spray it in your face. Eh? Oh, oh, that'll be it. That, that's nice. That smells like oranges. That's good. We've got a card that We've says... Got postcards. We can send <gasps> these postcards We've out. got postcards to send. And we can send the postcards we got. And um, I got a pen. And I've got some lip balm to make my lips all moist and for I was spooning at night. And I got a t-shirt. And... Um, and what else? And I got something to do with smosh shining things and who? Some people call some I've never read of them. No, no idea who they are. No. Biggest YouTubers or something? I don't know. And an aura brush because apparently my breath stinks, so that's what I need. What else would you have in the middle of a roundabout other than a great big blue tall building? What see, look at that. What what else what would the you heck have? That? I have no idea. 
Right, Johnny's editing over there in the background. I'm dying and I'm going to try and hopefully, fingers crossed, upload a video, my Slovakian vlog, uh, and get that up so that it's there ready for the morning for people to watch. However, the internet here sucks balls big time. <laughs> so it might not be up when it's meant to be up, but we'll get the video, we will get the video, we will get them up at some point, yeah? On the day. Absolutely, he's concentrating. But I promise it will be up on the day at some point. Anyway, I'm gonna read a few of your comments before I go to sleep and die. Uh, the Stig888 says, laugh my ass off, trust you to have misread the luggage scales uh, and have think you exceeded the weight limit. I know, I, was, I had like t almost 10 kilos less than John. It's ridiculous. Um, Manoli says, John is right, chill out and enjoy your trip. I've chilled out a bit today, I can promise you. Um, the the ooh, ooh Helka, uh, says, do you watch football? If yes, what team do you support? I'm a Liverpool supporter. And uh, thank you very much for the tips to London. It was really awesome, really. Want to go back someday. And sorry for my bad English, I'm still studying. Your English is perfect. Don't be ridiculous. And let's do one more comment. Uh, JD, the guru, says, the title of this video made no sense. It actually made sense. Okay, that didn't make any sense. It does make sense. Basically, it means don't put anything in your ears. You shouldn't ever put anything in your ears at all because you can burst your eardrum. However, everybody does take cotton wool buds or whatever they call here, Q-tips, and ram them in their ears to give them a good scrubbing out. That's what happens. Anyway, right, I'm gonna go, to, I, yeah, I'm gonna go to sleep. I'm rambling crap. It's cause I've been up for 30 hours without any sleep. Brilliant. See you guys tomorrow. Sleep tight, don't let the bad bugs bite. Sweet dreams, have a good one. You're watching Stop Jabbing On. Thumbles but shut up He's slugging here Stop jabbing on Like what up He's from the UK And he's anything but boring Stop jabbing on Starts his day with a